We're also, excuse me, learning more about an officer involved shooting in Raleigh. Michael Hendricks Jr. was shot on Sunday. CBS 17's Zach Dahlheimer is live in Raleigh digging deeper into a report about that shooting. Zach. Well, Marius, the report provides a lot of information as to what took place last Sunday, including that Hendricks had an airsoft gun. Now, at 9.30 last Sunday morning, Raleigh firefighters responded to a medical call on Falls of Noose Road. Police found Hendricks sitting on the floor of his apartment near a cardboard box. His roommate told fire crews Hendricks had a gun and kept it in that box. Hendricks then came around the building and walked towards the parking lot. Hendricks raised the gun and pointed at Officer C.T. Melochik. Other officers arrived. They told Hendricks to drop the gun. Hendricks pointed it. Melichick shot once, hitting Hendricks in the abdomen. Now, Hendricks was taken to Wake Med. We are working to get an update on his condition. Investigators say his weapon was a modified airsoft gun with no safety tip. Officer Melichick is on administrative duty. His body cam and two dash cams caught the incident. Now, a 911 call stated that Hendricks was armed with a knife and had a war flashback. Raleigh police say they haven't been able to find any record of military service by Hendricks. SBI is conducting an independent investigation of this shooting, and that will be presented to the Wake County DA once completed. Live in Raleigh, Zach Dahlheimer, CBS 17 News.